Well, Dr. Ben Carson's meteoric rise in politics has stunned a lot of people who watch politics. We caught up with the former neurosurgeon on the campaign trail. National correspondent John Roberts joins us live from Plain Pool uh, in Atlanta. John, good morning to you. <laughs> Martha, good morning to you. I did get a chance to spend some quality time with Dr. Carson on the road in both Alabama and in New Hampshire. And yes, I did have the opportunity to shoot a little pool with him. Dr. Carson has a reputation as being something of a shark around the pool table. And yes, he did beat me, but only by two balls. Carson has taken uh, a little bit of heat lately uh, as the campaign talk has turned to foreign policy in the wake of what happened in Paris. One of Carson's foreign policy consultants implied that he just doesn't get it when it comes to the Middle East. Carson dismissed those comments as the ramblings of an old man who doesn't really know him and told me he does have a solid grasp on foreign policy. He's paid attention to world affairs, the events, and been uh, you know, talking to people about it. So uh, have I, you know, created legislation about foreign policy? No. But again, I just say the proof is in the pudding. That said, though, Carson did acknowledge to me that he was at a pretty serious disadvantage on foreign policy when he started this process, but told me, Martha, he is fully up to speed on all of that now. Interesting. All right. Well, world events may keep the focus in that area, but he is planning yeah. to release a plan on Obamacare and what he would do to replace it, right? Yeah, and he's going to be coming out with that next month. And, and, and he gave me a little bit of a preview of what he's thinking about. Carson's plan really focuses on getting the bureaucracy out of health care and giving power back to the patients and doctors by using federal funds to fund health savings accounts. And not typical health savings accounts, but ones that have enormous flexibility. Listen. One of the real key differences here with any other type of health savings plan is that we give people the ability to shift money within their health savings account, uh, within their family, your uncle, your grandfather, your cousin, uh, which provides enormous flexibility to cover almost anything that comes up, except for uh, major catastrophic. For which Carson says people would still need to buy insurance, but that it would be very affordable. He says this will end any confusion about what he's talked about so far, Martha. We'll find out next month when he releases it. Interesting. John, thank you very much.